Good evening. We're really starting to see that snow accumulate here in Las Vegas. It appears a snow plow hasn't come through to clear this road right by the entrance to I-25. Now, we did speak with a couple of people who spend a lot of time on the roads, and they say they aren't traveling due to the snow. Tonight, winter weather moving into northeast New Mexico. I have to go over Raton Pass. I stopped because I saw the snow. David Bean is a truck driver. He was planning to head up to Denver to make a delivery. As you go up over the pass, it gets, it gets pretty steep and windy, and it's not necessarily that I can't make it up there, but I don't want to be up there when somebody else spins out. He's calling it a night for his safety. We have been aware of this storm, so I would say over 50 trucks for sure, and even more. Kim Gallegos with New Mexico Department of Transportation says before the storm, crews were salting the roads. And now that it's hitting, they're going in full force. We're going to be having additional officers out on the roadways and having additional officers on standby in case they're needed. Dusty Francisco with New Mexico State Police says officers will be ready to help those affected by the storm. Once it got into New Mexico, it started getting a little bit worse. John Clark left Denver today to drive a load to Phoenix. He's not driving tonight after seeing the storm, but for those who do plan to travel during the storm, he's got a message. Don't drive like an idiot. We're 80,000 pounds. We don't stop on the dime. Don't think we do because this right here kill you. Both New Mexico DOT and state police say don't travel unless you absolutely have to. And if you do, download this app, NM Roads, or go on their website, nmroads.com. It'll show you road conditions. It'll show you road closures, really everything you need to know before you hit the road. Reporting in Las Vegas, I'm Stella Sun, KOAT Action 7 News.